Hey everybody, this is Drew. Hey, I wanted to send you a message today. I wanted to send you a message of gratitude. As I reflect on the amazing year we had in 2016, I really want to just say thank you to you, every single one of you. I've had a personally a lot of growth in my life in 2016, both from a personal level and from a business level. I give you all the credit um, because without you, I wouldn't be able to grow. Um, specifically, I'd love to thank my family, specifically Kim, my wife, Emma, my daughter, my amazing family that is always 100% supportive of me and always kind of puts up with my shenanigans and still loves me anyway. Also, my business family, Kella Williams, the leadership team, and the new role that I accepted in the last year with the productivity coaching, my real estate agent clients. It's just been so amazing to be able to wrap my arms around you and embrace you and you and embrace me. Uh, and it's just amazing what we've done together. Uh, looking at the numbers, I look, we've almost closed $45 million in sales, over 192 homes we've already closed, which is huge. It's in, impacted us financially, but it's also impacted us from a personal level. I mean, think about 192 families times the buyer sell side. So almost 380 different people have been affected by this kind of ripple effect that's occurred in 2016. So I wanted to send you that love and gratitude. And then I'm challenging myself and I wanted to articulate that to you and maybe challenge you for 2017. When we go into gratitude, do we do it often enough? I know I don't. I know that I get focused on the mundane things, the emails, the t text messages, the work. But if we could go into 2017 with more gratitude, focusing on what we're grateful for, what maybe things we failed forward and we can learn from, I think we'd even be better. So I love you guys. Thank you so much for an amazing year. I wish you a happy holiday season and a very productive new year. Thanks, guys.